let's talk about back pain. Common, unbelievable, the most common cause of back pain without question is musculoskeletal, you know, strained muscle. We're not gonna talk about that. And then of course you could talk about metastatic disease. We're not gonna talk about that right here. What we're gonna talk about is something called lumbar disc herniation. Meaning, remember you got your vertebral bodies and they're separated by discs, shock absorbers. And the shock absorbers are kind of like a jelly donut in a way, meaning you got the outside of the disc, which is fibrous, an annulus, and you got the inside of the disc, which is like the jelly of the jelly donut, which is the nucleus pulposus. And what happens very simply is that outside annulus ring, fibrous ring, ruptures, and the nucleus pulposus, the jelly comes out and pushes against nerve. And that causes a radiculopathy, which we sometimes called sciatica. Okay, is this common? Oh, yes. So one of the first questions that we always ask is, what age is it common? 30s, 40s, or 50? And it's actually in the 40s. And do you know why? Remember when we talked about Achilles tendon rupture? And we talked about in the 40s that the tendons and all the tissues get a little bit dry, brittle, and stiff. Same thing here. The annulus, the annulus, as you get into your 40s, gets a little brittle, gets a little stiff, and is, is not as flexible as it was and is at your age. So when someone has lumbar disc herniation, they will have sciatica. And if you've ever seen a patient who has sciatica, you're talking about unbelievable pain because it's described as lightning or an electricity down your leg. And it's very severe. Test question, life question. If the lightning, meaning the pain, comes out of your big toe, it is L4, L5. Big toe, L4, L5. If it's your baby toe, L5, S1. Guys, for the test and life, you need to know that. Even though you're going to get an MRI, you're going to get an MRI to define it. This you need to know. Big toe, L4, L5. Baby toe, L5, S1. Now, the most important thing that I can tell you, every patient who potentially comes in with sciatica and a lumbar disc herniation, you have to ask about two organ systems, GI and GU, gastrointestinal and genitourinary, meaning if they're having trouble with their sphincter, their GI sphincters, or they're having trouble with their GU sphincters, that is a surgical emergency, a surgical emergency. And that is called cauda equina syndrome. And that is a surgical emergency. Again, this is so important. It's on your test and for life. Lumbar disc herniation is real common. People can get it with just falling down, coughing, sneezing, it, it, it's just common in the 40s. You must always ask about two systems, GI and GU. And if they're having trouble with their GI system, meaning their sphincters aren't working, or GU and their sphincters aren't working, that's called equina, and that is an emergency. Let me tell you a story. 